Hey, hi, ha, oh, again. Yes, it's your birthday man himself, the one and only and truly DLG repping. Welcome again to my channel, bring you another football content. Um, so ladies and gentlemen, to the boys, to the girls, all football fans of different races, culture, religion, etc., Smash a thumbs up like button for me, yeah? Share this channel by smashing that share button, yeah? Left, right and centre, galore. And do it passionately. Make sure you share this channel virally all over the, the globe. Make sure your friends and relatives get hold of this, yeah? Tell them to share it amongst their friends and relatives. Comment section, flood it with your positive feedback only, yeah? Your opinions, your thoughts, etc. And um, don't just view, like and comment. Make sure you subscribe to the channel, yeah? Let's get over one... Uh, let's get over 1,000 subscribers. That's my aim now. I'm going for 1,000 subscribers. So with your help, I can do it. So... Keep subscribing. Smash the subscribe button hard and passionately and galore. And on top of that, yeah, if you subscribe, I'll shout you out, yeah? And um, I'll help you by bringing you the latest football content. So, it's good afternoon again. Or is it good morning? Or is it good evening? Wherever you're watching, um, I'm going to bring you another football content. And let's um, go through the headlines um, that I've got in front of me. Manchester United have agreed a fee with um, Varane and Real Madrid to bring the France international into Old Trafford for next season. The, the fee has been agreed and it's for around £34 million. To think that Arsenal paid £16 million more than Manchester United for a centre-back would not have thought it. Um... Former Premier League player Joey Barton pleaded not guilty on assaulting his wife. I'll read into that later on. And then Tuesday's transfer talk. So let's um, start off with Manchester United here. The head title written in yellow because they have agreed a fee for Rafael Varane to believe... To believe to be, yeah, to believe to, yeah, to believe that it's um, agreed on thirty four million pounds. Anyway, Man United agree with Varane fee with Real Madrid. Real Madrid defender Rafael Varane is near to joining Manchester United for an initial fee of around thirty four million. Final deals, final details are still to be agreed. But Varane has told Real he has he had no wish to extend his current contract, which has a year to run. The deal for Varane is likely to reach forty two million with add ons. Excuse me, I need a bit of water, these hiccups. Here I am. Big up. Or should I say, yes. Mm. Yes, massive shout out to Avian here, yeah? Keep doing your thing, what you've been doing for many years. The deal is the deal for Varane is likely to reach forty two million with add ons. Real have made a solidarity payment to Varane's previous clubs for their part in his development to ensure the transfer goes through. Yep. Oh so I'll tell you what, the agent fee's been agreed, personal terms have been agreed, his wages you're looking at hundred and fifty to two hundred and fifty thousand a week. If you include these um release clause etc so we're looking at um a cheap deal a cheaper deal for Manchester United because over the years they've paid 70 to 90 odd million for players 
and to get Varane on the cheap that will rise to 42 million that is um that is a good bargain and good business um done by Manchester United uh, Manchester United fans how excited and pleased are you to see um, Rafael Varane um, in the Premier League and playing for the Red Devils. Leave it in the comment section below. Right, let's go on to Jerry Barton here. <clears throat> as it's as it's um, written in yellow writing, that's the head title. Jerry Barton pleads not guilty to assaulting wife. Now, this guy and trouble is never far away. Or controversy is never far away from Jerry Barton. Former Premier League footballer Jerry Barton has denied attacking his wife, leaving her with a head injury. Whew. The Bristol man the Bristol Rovers manager is charged with assaulting Georgia Barton by beating in Q. That didn't make sense there what I just read. London on the second of June. He allegedly grabbed Mrs. Barton by the throat and kicked her in the head outside a property where they had been with two friends. The court heard Mr. Barton, 38 of Witness Cheshire, appeared before Wimbledon Magistrates Court by video link. Okay. Well, um, he's denied um, assaulting his wife. Um, I'm starting to lean towards um, the fact that he's lied about it and I, I'm I'm starting to lean towards the fact that he actually did it but um, if he's denied it then that's coming from him but if there's any CCTV footages or eyewitness that um can say um different then Joey Barton faces um a short spell in prison and it's of his own fault because if he has lied to the court and try to prevent the court of justice, then it's his own fault. Especially if CCTV or an eyewitness can prove that um, Joey Barton did exactly what he said he denied, then he's in trouble. But anyway, let's move on to the gossip column. And um, as, it, as um, it's been coming from... <coughs> Many uh, newspaper articles like The Athletic, Manchester United will sign Real Madrid and France defender Rafael Varane on a four-year deal with an option of a fifth year. But a date for the 28-year-old's medical is unclear because of quarantine restrictions. Newcastle are pushing to sign former England on the 21 defender Axel Twenzebi from Manchester United. Now, if that is on a permanent deal, then Newcastle have got themselves a hell of a, hell of a talented defender. And um, if Twain Zabie feels um, happy to join Newcastle on a permanent basis, then I wish him all the best. Juventus are keen to sell Aaron Ramsey this summer as the Wells midfielder is seen by the club as a financial burden. Wow. 400000 a week. I don't think Juventus can keep that up. I can, I can see why they call him a financial burden. <laughs> but, it, you know, he was um, a key player for Arsenal as an attacking midfield player who got us goals. And that is what we um, crave for right now. That's what we're looking for, a midfielder of Ramsey's ilk, but at the age of 22, 23. Anyway, Ben White is expected to have his Arsenal medical on Wednesday with a 50 million deal for the England defender having been agreed with Brighton last week. That's um, coming from Sky Sports News. Yeah, Ben, uh, ben White. Um, I mean, Fabrizio Romano has um, confirmed this himself. Excuse me. Romano Lukaku is happy at Inter Milan and the uh, Belgium striker is not planning on leaving the club this summer despite interest from Chelsea. Tottenham are stepping up their attempts to sign Atalanta's Argentine centre-back Christian Romero for £40 million. Now, he would be a direct replacement for um, Toby Alderweireld in the long run. He's 23 years, of, 23 years of age, from Argentina, and he's an Argentinian international. And the fee is, to be believed, about £40 million. This is coming from the Telegraph, if you believe what's 
been said by the um, reporter there or the guy or the person who wrote this story. Aston Villa's bid to sign Bayer Leverkusen's Jamaica winger Leon Bailey has been complicated by Leicester, Everton, Wolves and Southampton showing an interest in the 23-year-old who could be available for 30 million. Wow, he's only 23. It feels like he's been around for a lot longer than four or five years. But a complete, a frigging talent he is. And I mean he is a frigging talent. Whoever gets him in the Premier League, I'll tell you what, they'll be fortunately blessed with his um, abilities. Pace, dribbling ability, eye for goal, assists. He's got the lot for me. And I think he will adapt to the Premier League um, when, if and when given time. Um, Barcelona are yet to receive any contract Contact from clubs interested in signing France forward Anton Griezmann. Surely there will be a one or two. There will be a couple of big clubs after him. And I mean a couple of the clubs. They must be interested in Maybe Atletico Madrid might um, take a chance with him and re-sign him for the second time. Sheridan Security looks set to leave Liverpool this summer with Napoli and Lazio among the clubs keen to sign the Switzerland winger. Arsenal are considering a move for Portuguese winger Mochoy Dalu, 18, who is available for about 1 million from Pacos de Ferrer. Oh, that's right up Arsenal Street. 1 million. That is not going to be a, a problem. Not at all, at the slightest. If they want to sign this guy, then I'll wish them all the very, very, very best. West Ham are keen on signing, and plus it's come from the sun. So, you know what? If any newspaper article are going to be reliable, it's got to be the Sun. But when it comes to information on signings, I watch. I would rather watch Sky Sports News. West Ham United are keen on signing Denmark defender Jan Steger Larsen, who is in the final year of his contract at Udinese and would cost four point two million. Now you don't really get um, those um, players going for those sort of deals. And especially that sort of price. What, 4.2 million is a snip, I suppose. And if it's coming from football.london, then, well, believe it or not believe it. And um, that's me done for the transfer and gossip column. Otherwise, yet again, ladies, gentlemen, to the boys, to the girls, I forever thank you for watching. Thank you for listening. Thank you for tuning in. Thank you for um, listening. And yes, you know, you know, I'm going to say it again and again. Saving the best to the last. There it goes. Thank you for always putting up with me. And today, you're putting up with me on my birthday. Credit to you guys. Take care of your friends. Take care of your family. Take care of yourselves. Make sure you stay safe um, in this... Um, Average weather in London, England, or wherever you're watching around the world, please, um, yeah, please ask any questions on what I've been speaking about, whether it's something about the tr um, the gossip column, Varane's uh, move to Man United, or Joey Barton's um, assault on, on his wife. Leave it in the comment section below. Smash the thumbs up like button. Do me a favour and share this channel all over the world. But last but not least, viewers, don't just share comment and like make sure you smash my subscribe button for me on my birthday let's get some subscribers overall i'm going for 1000 subscribers and over that's where i want to be so keep um supporting the channel showing me love and giving me that respect yeah love respect back and support back to you as well yeah I'll be back hopefully this evening. If not, it'll be tomorrow. Otherwise, I'm going to have a couple of birthday drinks later on this afternoon. So, um, wish me well on that. Otherwise, have a nice day. And do remember, peace, love and bless again. And remember also, just be nice.